Applique designs are easy in the Simple Cut software. Click the New icon and in the Techniques dialog, select both Cut and Embroidery from the techniques available. Select Create New Design. Select the Text icon and click to begin to generate text. Use the drop-down menu to select the font of your choice and type to generate your text. Select the text by selecting the Rectangle Select icon. Select the Artwork icon and select a color for the fill and a color for an outline. You can then zoom out, resize your applique to the appropriate size. You can always see the size of your design when you hover over the top by selecting it or in the Tool Options menu. In the Object Properties Outline tab, select Cut for your technique. Select the cutter presets by clicking cutter preset and select your fabric with Material Magic or backed with a fusible webbing. This will preset all the settings for your cutter. Select File, Export to Cutter. Connect to your cutter and preview your design and test your settings. Trace and cut your design. Close the dialog box. To create the coordinating machine applique for your pre-cut fabric, first save your design file, save as, and save this as applique-cut and save. With the design selected, click on the Object Properties Fill tab and select Applique. Since we've pre-cut the piece, select Fabric Trim and use the drop-down menu to select Pre-Cut. This indicates we'll be using a pre-cut piece and the embroidered design will create an outline for us to place the pieces in. Then it will finish with whatever stitch we select in the Outline tab. Select the Outline tab and select Running. This will let you select from almost 400 different applique stitches. I'm going to select stitch number 94. I notice that the stitch is going in the wrong direction, so place a check mark in mirror style. I can always change the length and width of my stitch by placing a check mark in the length dialog, typing in a new value and enter. And in the outline tab up in tool options, you can change the width of the stitch. I'm working in inches, so I'll enter an equivalent of about three millimeters and change the length the width and direction of any of the stitches you select. To send this to the embroidery machine, File, Save As, select Save As Type, and select your appropriate file format, and save to the computer or USB stick to go directly to the machine. You also have the opportunity to export your file to Dropbox or the Janome 12 or 15,000 machines. To save the file, select File, Save As, and save this file with an amendment for Applique and Save.